The University of Missouri St. Louis, UMSL, is a public research university located near St. Louis, Missouri, United States. Established in 1963, it is one of four universities in the University of Missouri system and its newest. UMSL's campus is located on the former grounds of the Bellarive Country Club in St. Louis County, with an address in St. Louis City. The campus stretches into the municipalities of Bellarive, Belle Nor and Normandy. Additional facilities are located at the former site of Marillac College and at Grand Center, both in St. Louis City. Bachelor's, Master's, and Doctoral programs are offered through the College of Arts and Sciences, the College of Business Administration, the College of Education, the College of Nursing, the School of Social Work, and the College of Optometry. The business school is AACSB accredited and is the only university in the St. Louis area to also be AACSB accredited in accounting. Pre-professional, a joint engineering program with Washington University in St. Louis, and evening programs are also offered. UMSL is home of an optometry school, providing its students with a doctorate OD. Only 17 optometry schools exist in all of North America including Puerto Rico. The Pierre Leclede Honors College is UMSL's honors program. The university contains two libraries, the Thomas Jefferson Library which is the main library of the university and the St. Louis Mercantile Library which was founded in 1846 and is the oldest library west of the Mississippi River. The campus contains two stops on Metrolink, St. Louis Regional Light Rail System. A student center, academic buildings, parking structures, a performing arts center, and residential housing have been constructed over the past 10 years as part of campus improvement programs. The university has a dual enrollment agreement with Gulf University for Science and Technology, Kuwait. KWMU 90.7 FM, which is the flagship national public radio station in the St. Louis area and known on air as St. Louis Public Radio, is owned by and licensed to UMSL. 71.6% of its undergraduate classes have 29 or fewer students, and 46.2% have 19 or fewer students. The student faculty ratio is 16 to 1. 2013, UMSL has 10,431 students attending classes on campus, compared to 6,010 students taking classes off campus, which is mostly students dual enrolled at area high schools. The university has the equivalent of 9,488 full time students. UMSL has historically been a commuter school for the St. Louis, with only about 1,200 students living on campus, though the school is making active efforts to bring more students to live on campus. History The impetus for a college campus in its current location began in 1957 when members of the Bellarive Country Club put their 53-year-old club house and 125-acre grounds on the market for $1.3 million as they planned to move to larger quarters in town and country, Missouri. At the same time members of Normandy, Missouri School District began debating the need of creating an affordable junior college to offer an alternative to the much more expensive privately owned St. Louis University and Washington University in St. Louis. Country club members approached the board and the asking price was dropped to $600,000. A bond issue on September 30, 1958, received the necessary two-thirds majority and the golf club was turned over to Normandy on May 31, 1960. A group of board members and citizens popularly referred to as the Committee of 28 began the process to set up the junior college. The group was to meet with Elmer Ellis, president of the University of Missouri. At the time, MU was responsible for accrediting junior colleges. 
Ellis suggested that the University of Missouri supervise the educational program at the school. The terms required that 100 students attend the school. 140 students applied on the first day. The clubhouse was renovated with 15 classrooms, two laboratories, a large lecture room, a library and a cafeteria. The Normandy Residence Center under the auspices of the University of Missouri opened in September 1960. Enrollment increased to 300 in 1961 and 550 in 1962. Interest in a four-year school immediately arose. In 1963, the original MU campuses in Columbia and Rolla were merged with the privately owned University of Kansas City to form the present-day University of Missouri system. The newly formed system immediately won permission to upgrade the Normandy Center to a full-fledged four-year institution. The transfer from the Normandy School District to the University of Missouri system was delayed when the Missouri Supreme Court in 4-3 decision ruled that the school could not transfer the property without a formal open bid process. The Missouri General Assembly enacted legislation signed by Governor John Dalton on October 13, 1963, enabling the transfer and the university bought the property for $60,000 from unallocated funds at the university's disposal, with expanding enrollment classes were held in a laundromat building at Natural Bridge and Hanley and in a church basement across from the campus while buildings were built on the site of the former Bellarive Country Club. Benton Hall opened in 1965, Clark Hall and the library were the next buildings built. On July 23, 1973, an Ozark Airlines Fairchild Hiller FH-227B Flight 809 from Nashville International Airport crashed into the campus just east of the Mark Twain complex while attempting to land at Lambert Street. Louis International Airport 37 passengers and one crew member were killed although four passengers and two crew members including the captain survived. There had been reports of a tornado at Ladue at the time but the weather service did not confirm it. In 1976 Marillac College was acquired. It is now called the South Campus. Topic. Express Scripts World Headquarters Campus at North Park In 2007 Express Scripts opened its world headquarters on the campus north of University Place Drive and south of Interstate 70 in Missouri. It is the first Fortune 500 company to have its headquarters on a college campus it was ranked the 22nd largest company in the United States in 2017. A second headquarters building adjoining the original one opened in 2008. Three additional express scripts have been added to the North Park development on the north side of I-70 including an office and data center, tech and innovation center, and operations center. In 2018 the majority of the 5,000 St. Louis Express Scripts employees work in the complex. George Paz, CEO of Express Scripts at the time, was a new MSL graduate. Express Scripts which leases rather than owns its headquarters buildings and other structures in North Park received substantial tax breaks. Since the move the company has been an active partner with the university including contributing money to renovate the Computer Sciences Building Express Scripts Hall, raising funds for building projects, sponsoring a pre-collegiate bridge program for high school students and sponsoring a business incubator Accentuate. Topic. Academics. Topic. Academic units 
Divisions of the university include, the College of Arts and Sciences, the College of Business Administration, the College of Education, the College of Fine Arts and Communication, the College of Nursing, the College of Optometry, the Pierre Leclerc Honors College, the School of Social Work, Continuing Education, the Graduate School, and the UMSL, Washington University Joint Undergraduate Engineering Program. The College of Arts and Sciences has these divisions. Topic research and public service centers The university's centers include, the Center for Business and Industrial Studies, the Center for Character and Citizenship, the Center for Emerging Technologies, the Center for Entrepreneurship and Economic Education, the Center for Ethics and Public Life, the Center for Eye Care, the Center for Excellence in Financial Counseling, the Center for Human Origin and Cultural Diversity, the Center for the Humanities, the Center for Inter International Studies, the Center for Nanoscience, the Center for Neurodynamics, the Center for Transportation Studies, the Center for Trauma Recovery, the Children's Advocacy Services of Greater St. Louis, the E. Desmond Lee Regional Institute of Tutorial Education, the E. Desmond Lee Technology and Learning Center, the German Cultural Center, the International Business Institute, the Missouri Institute of Mental Health, the Nicholas and Theodora Matsakis. Hellenic Culture Center, the Public Policy Research Center, St. Louis Public Radio, the Sue Shear Institute for Women in Public Life, and the Whitney R. Harris World Ecology Center. Topic rankings U.S. News & World Reports America's Best Graduate Schools 2018 ranks its doctoral degree program in Criminology and Criminal Justice 5th in the U.S. The Department of Criminology and Criminal Justice was also ranked second for scholarly research by the Journal of Criminal Justice. The Philosophical Gourmet Report lists UMSL's Terminal Master's Program in Philosophy in the top ten nationally. This report is widely cited as a primary source in ranking philosophy graduate programs and publishes biennially. In 2007, UMSL's Information Systems Business Faculty were ranked third in the nation in productivity. The university's Counselor Education Faculty have been ranked in the top ten by Academic Analytics. Academic Analytics Faculty Scholarly Productivity Index ranked UMSL fifth in the category of universities with less than 15 doctoral programs, just behind Georgetown University. U.S. News & World Report ranked the International Business Undergraduate Program 15th for 2010. That was the seventh time the program was ranked in the top 20. The Journal of Communication ranked the Communication Program 5th nationally for faculty productivity. The Evolutionary Biology faculty at UMSL have been, by productivity, ranked in the top 20 by Academic Analytics. Topic. Athletics UMSL provides 11 Division II sports teams ranging from soccer and basketball to golf and softball. Topic. Campus The campus is divided into two parts, a North Campus and a South Campus. UMSL can be visited using the St. Louis Metrolink light rail system which has two stations on the campus, UMSL North and UMSL South. Some key buildings include the Thomas Jefferson and Mercantile Libraries, the Transportation Studies Center, University Meadows Apartments, the Millennium Student Center, Residential Life and Housing, Clark and Lucas Halls, the Towhill Performing Arts Center, Express Scripts Hall formerly CCB, and the Social Sciences Building. The Ward E. Barnes Library is located on the South Campus and serves the College of Education and the College of Optometry. Finally, there is currently a Campus Recreation Center. Chancellors <laughs> 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 Chancellors of the school are 
James Bug, 1965 to 1969. Glenn Driscoll, 1969 to 1972. Everett Walters, interim, 1972–1973 Joseph Hartley, 1973–1974 Emery Turner, interim, 1974–1975 Arnold Grobman, 1975–1985 Arthur McKinney, interim, 1985–1986 Marguerite Ross Barnett, 1986–1990 Blanche Towhill, 1990 to 2002. Donald Dreyermeyer, interim, 2003. Thomas F. George, 2003 present. Topic: Student life. Topic: Housing. Campus housing, Villa North Hall, ages 21 plus, and Oak Hall, under 21. Additional campus living, University Meadows Apartments, independently operated, gated, apartment-style living, the Mansion Hills, ages 21 plus. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Student Government Association. The UMSL Student Government Association SGA is a student-run government set up to provide a voice for students when dealing with administration of the University of Missouri St. Louis, UMSL. SGA has three parts, the executive branch, the assembly, and the student court, and also is governed by a student-wide approved constitution. SGA was started in 1963 when the university was founded and has gone through many constitutional changes, the most recent in 2004. SGA includes members from every student organization and students from every college on campus. This government incorporates both undergraduate and graduate in its student body. SGA has been instrumental in changes for students around the campus. It is responsible for approving student fees before they go to the Board of Curators of the University of Missouri System and divides out the campus activities fees to fund student organizations' budgets. <laughs> <laughs> Greek life There are seven social fraternities and sororities on campus. The fraternities are Pi Kappa Alpha, Sigma Tau Gamma, Sigma Pi, and Alpha Sigma Phi. Sororities include, Alpha Xi Delta, Delta Zeta, Zeta Tau Alpha. There are also historically black Greek letter organizations BGLO that function at the University of Missouri-St. Louis campus. Majority of the BGLO chapters function as citywide chapters including Alpha Phi Alpha, Alpha Kappa Alpha, Kappa Alpha Psi, Omega Psi Phi, Delta Sigma Theta, Phi Beta Sigma, and Zeta Phi Beta, while Sigma Gamma Rho has a charter specifically at the University of Missouri-St. Louis. <laughs> <laughs> Student media. The student newspaper, The Current, is a tabloid publishing 6,000 issues weekly. It is funded primarily by advertising revenue supplemented by student activity fees. The Current has won Best in State from the Missouri Collegiate Media Association in 2002, 2007, 2008, and 2009. The campus hosts a student radio station, UMSL Student Radio, The U, on 1620 AM and streaming online and UTV which streams in the campus dorms and YouTube channel, too. The main studios are located on the second floor of the Millennium Student Center, with a satellite studio in the Oak Hall residence. The stations is organized by the Student Electronic Media Professionals Association SEMPA. 
The U has a non-commercial freeform format, playing various genres of music and talk shows as well as programs featuring campus news and personalities. The Film Production Society was established in 2006. This organization has since changed its name to the Media Production Society. It manufactures original content, tutors students in need, and researches new forms of modern media. Topic. Nickname and mascot In May 2007 the UMSL Board of Curators approved a change of nickname from the Rivermen first used in the 1960s to the Tritons. The new mascot was revealed at the Pack the Stands Night, Fall 2009 and was named Louis by the student body at the annual Mirthday Celebration, Spring 2010. The Riverman, Riverwomen nickname seldom had popular support, primarily for its unwieldy gender constructions. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Official song. The university song is "With Majesty," featuring words and music by John Francis Dill and Diane Seccarini. Topic dining The university features multitude of places to eat, particularly in the Millennium Student Center MSC. The NOSH, the most popular dining facility, is located on the MSC lower level. It has Pizza Hut Express, Wow American Cafe and Windery, AFC Sushi, Far East Fusion, Stir Fry, a soup and salad bar, the Daily Dish, Daily Specials and Breakfast, and Simply to Go Fresh Deli with made to order sandwiches and wraps. Also on the MSC lower level, Subway is located in the Pilot House. In the MSC second floor rotunda, there is an Einstein Brothers Bagels and there will soon be a frozen yogurt and baked goods outlet. Pony Expresso is located in the Social Sciences and Business Building SSB. South Campus houses the Provincial House Dining Hall with all-you-can-eat Sodexo food on demand. It is also home to the Southside Cafe featuring daily hot specials and breakfast. Topic. Institutional safety Law enforcement and emergency response on the UMSL campus is handled by the University of Missouri St. Louis Police Department. Other divisions within institutional safety include, Department of Environmental Health and Safety, Parking and Transportation, and Campus Locksmiths. Topic. Pierre Leclerc Honors College The Pierre Leclerc Honors College is the honors program for the University of Missouri St. Louis. It was named in honor of the founder of the city of St. Louis. With classrooms and student housing both located in a former convent on the university's south campus, the program offers classes that typically focus on specific topics in the humanities while stressing the development and practice of students' writing skills. The students in the program publish an informal periodical, Brain Stew, which is independent of the current. The college is also the center of activity for the publication of Bellarive, an annual literary magazine which contains artistic and literary works by UMSL students and faculty. Topic: Alumni. The university has 92,230 graduates, with 62,408 of them in the metropolitan St. Louis area. Notable faculty Hassan Ali al-Shibaz, adjunct professor of biology and curator at the Missouri Botanical Gardens 
Joseph Carroll, Curator's Professor of English, pioneering scholar in the field of literature and evolution. Janet Catherine Burlow, Art History Professor, 1979 to 1997. Michael Cosmopoulos, Hellenic Government Caracas Foundation Chair of Greek Studies and Professor of Archaeology. Barbara Harbach, Professor of Music. Min Su Kang, Professor of History. Tom McPhail, Professor of Media Studies, Fellow in the Center for International Studies. Mark Pope, Counselor, Thomas Jefferson Professor, Curator's Distinguished Professor Emeritus of Counseling, 1997 to 2018. George Rorick, Robert E. Rickolfs, Curator's Professor of Biology, Member of the National Academy of Sciences. Lawrence H. White, Peter F. Stevens, Daniel Isom, former St. Louis Police Department Chief of Police, E. Desmond Lee Professor of Policing and the Community. Topic Notable alumni Paul Kurtman, Republican member of the Missouri House of Representatives Kathleen E. Fick, Air National Guard Major General Chuck Gatchenberger, Republican member of the Missouri House of Representatives Timothy P. Green, Missouri State Politician Marty Hendon, former Vice President of Community Relations for the St. Louis Cardinals Charles E. Hoffman, Dean of Business School 2013, Joan Kelly Horn, former United States Congress Congresswoman Daniel Isom, former St. Louis City Chief of Police William Nodelsida, Pulitzer Prize-winning author, former business writer for the Los Angeles Times and TV producer Richard Lindner, Chief Financial Officer and Senior Executive Vice President of AT&T Kevin Mansell, Chief Executive Officer of Coles Corporation Therese Sander, Missouri politician Vincent Schoemail, Mayor of the City of St. Louis, 1981-1993 Phyllis Smith, television and film actress Chrissy Sommer, Republican member of the Missouri House of Representatives Steve Stenger, Democrat politician and county executive of St. Louis County Stephen Tilley, Missouri Speaker of the House of Representatives Karen Marie Shelton, Internet and telephony entrepreneur Clint Zweifel, Missouri State Treasurer Prince Ayer, rapper and activist Lida Crewson, Mayor of St. Louis Hannah Perryman, at the time of her graduation in 2016, Perryman was the NCAA Softball Division II career leader in Perfect Games 9, career strikeouts 1,725 and strikeouts per seven innings 12. 1, and the first Division II player ever drafted by a professional softball team Akron Racers. <laughs>